everybody, Keith Beavers, Tastings Director of Vine Pair, and we're gonna review Early Mountain's chillable red young wine. But before we do anything, please subscribe to Vine Pair's YouTube channel. Like, thank you. Okay, guys, let's talk about Virginia. It is becoming if not is already one of the most important wine producing regions we have in the United States of America. It has a very, very rich history of winemaking, but what's really, really exciting about Virginia is what's happening right now. And Early Mountain Vineyards is at the forefront of what's happening now. Early Mountain has a nice long lineup of wines from age-worthy wines to sort of playful wines. And this is one of their playful wines. It's called Young Wine, literally quote unquote, young wine. And this is another thing that's very, very exciting about Virginia, is they're playing around with hybrids. Now I know hybrids have had a bad rap in the past, but the thing about Early Mountain and, and, and what's going on in Virginia is they're cracking the code. They're figuring out how to make great wine out of hybrids. This wine happens to be a blend of two hybrids, Chambersin and Vida Blanc. The cool thing is, this is called a co-ferment wine. They fermented both varieties together. And when that happens, a different kind of science happens in wine and you get all just completely different kinds of results. If a Chambersin was done by itself or a Vidal Blanc, I mean, one's a red, one, Chambersin's a red grape, Vidal Blanc is a white grape, vinified separately, they would have completely different aromas, but when they're co-fermented, things get magical. This is exciting. We chilled this wine down a little bit, by the way. Chillable red is awesome. The thing is with this wine is a lot of people talk about the foxiness of a hybrid. It's not here. This wine is grapey. Yeah, I said grapey. It's okay because it's made from grapes. If you ever smell a wine and you smell grapiness, say it out loud. It's totally okay. But beyond the grapiness, I get, you know, it's hard to say when you talk about berries, you don't really need to single out one berry because this gives like a bright berry fruit. I mean, it basically smells like all the berries. But the key is it's balanced. There's a slight savory note as well. This is a very, very well done wine. Oh, oh, this is so good. The cool thing with this wine, it's punchy, it's juicy, it's fun, it's laid back, it's porch wine material, but it has a little bit of tannin to it. So this is the kind of wine that is casual and easy, like for pizza and burgers, but it does, and this is why Early Mountain is so great, it has a structure to it. It has definition. It's wild. I know they're making this for fun, but it's kind of a serious wine. If you want, go to vinepair.com, read my full review, but because of everything I said, I gave this wine a 91. So there you have it, Young Wine by Early Mountain Vineyards. This wine's amazing. This is the wine you have with burgers. This is the wine you have with pizza. This is the wine you have with friends, cheese plates, movies, everything, Netflix, board game night, whatever you want. This is one of the most versatile wines out there. Have you heard of Early Mountain? Have you had this wine? Let me know down in the comments or if you had any kind of co-ferments with hybrids. Have you had hybrids? What do you think about hybrids? Let me know in the comments. Until next time, I'm Keith Beavers.